But most of it was how do we protect life and limb? How do we get everything done in the PMAC? And the answer turned out to be that we had to move people from the, we had to make the PMAC a, uh, now this wasn't my decision, we had to make a PMAC the trauma triage uh, center. And we had to use the field house, which was never really used before, for those that were healthier but had no place to go. Of course, it wasn't, I don't think it's a political thing. I, you know, it wasn't handled well on a federal level, you know, obviously. And those things overflowed onto the LSU campus, which was the Hurricane Center. At one time, uh, 24 hours a day, there were sirens from the ambulance, and I would say the helicopters never stopped. They landed on the track, okay, and then EMS people took them inside. Uh, we were fortunate. Well, that's why it was picked. But uh, we were, you know, there's a place for the helicopters to land and a place uh, where even President Bush landed and visited and we cut a hole in the fence so he wouldn't have to go as far. And, uh, <laughs> you know, that's how strong it really was 